Hello to my YT fam, my YT fam. Welcome to my video. Welcome to my love. Welcome to our help, my YT fam. Hey, hey, my YT fam, my YT fam. Welcome to my video. Welcome to my love. Welcome to our help, my YT fam. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, back with another video, my YT fam. Happy Thursday. Happy Thursday. And um, I'm here to do a lovely grocery haul slash uh, the reason why I started my weight loss journey. Okay, but first we're gonna step into the grocery haul. Okay, okay. Um, this is Italian flat out herb Italian. And it's the wrap, it's the light kind, and um, it's only 90 calories, you know, so that's what I got. And, take a good one. And, I brought some of these, the light spinach, flat out. It is good, y'all, y'all could, um, what you could do with these, it's like, you could borrow you some chicken, um, you can have turkey burgers. You can, um, whatever you, you know, as long as it's healthy, like, okay? This is the only way. You know, it'll help you stay away from the breads and stuff like that. But this is really good, y'all. I like this better than I do the regular bread. So, like, if I want me and babe to have us a turkey burger, all you gotta do is just cut it up, you know, cut it up into pieces and make you a wrap and put your lettuce, whatever you like on there, bam, you know. But, uh, but yeah, and brought me some more of this, this Stay Fit and Wilderness, you know, it's got, um, it's got um, spinach, Let me read it. Okay. It's got spinach, uh, apple. Wait a minute. Let me read this. Spinach, mangoes, and apples and pineapples. So, you know, me and babe, we had one for breakfast this morning, and y'all talking about. Ooh, okay. we add a banana off in there. Mm -hmm. Y'all, I'm telling y'all, it was off the chain this morning. So, you know. So this is what I got, you know, and we got the, the whatever you call it, protein strength, you know, makes, it makes healthy and delicious smoothie. This we got pineapples, bananas, mangoes, and whatever else. So, you know, this is another great smoothie. So I'm telling y'all, your girl is on the ball, y'all. Your girl is on the ball. That's what we got. So, and um, uh, like me, I really don't do the almond milk, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try it again. But for right now, I'm doing this right here: the coconut, coconut water. You know, the coconut water. Sodium only 55. That ain't bad. So it's like a low sodium, you know. So this is what I got for this smoothie. So yeah, see that coconut, coconut water. And I got two of them. You know, two of them. So. And got um, some turkey burgers. I'm gonna season some up so that way me and babe can have some. Supper, 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 supper. And I brought some sweet potato wraps, you know. Okay, I'm gonna try some of that. So sweet potato wrap, you know. I'm gonna try some of that. That is called Be Free. B, the letter B. I know what I'm saying. 
free. Sweet potato wrap. So I'm gonna try some of that. You know, when I'm saying. And I brought me some Jello. I brought me some Jello. So like when I want something to snack on, you know, Jello. So it's only 70 calories, so it's okay. And uh, I brought some turkey meatballs. So like sometimes, like if I want to make a meatball uh, wrap, you know, cut the meatballs up. You know, and that's what I could do. Hey, and and this right here, y'all. These right here is a healthy, <coughs> healthy, healthy vegan bites. These are like oatmeal cookies. You know, the oatmeal. So they are very good. They only got um two grams of sugar that ain't bad and when you eat these y'all when you eat these you could get them from your Publix or probably a health food store and ain't no telling but I, I brought some of these from Publix I tried them yesterday y'all they was off the chain when they baby that's right I mean they are so good they hey. vegan see vegan healthy vegan bites they just like little cookies you know you know they are little cookies you know but they taste more better than the, re the real the original cookies so and yeah I'm sweating so it's helping me to lose weight yeah and I brought some more healthy oatmeal healthy oatmeal bites they are good, y'all. Very good. You know, and I only ate one last night, and I ate one this this afternoon. And I mean, they are very good. Baby even tried them. So, you know. And I brought some more tuna, pepper, pine. Herb and garlic, herb and garlic, herb and garlic. They all the same kind, y'all. See? Wait a minute. Sorry, y'all. That kind right there, herb, herb and garlic. Herb and garlic. I like herb and garlic. It tastes more better. Herb and garlic. Hey, hey, hey. They all herb and garlic. So, that's it for the grocery haul. Babe got him something. You know, y'all know how Babe shop. Y'all know how Babe shops, okay? So, I'm trying to help Babe out. The Babe buys what he want to buy. So, y'all know how me and are. <laughs> But anyway, uh, yeah, I wanted to talk to y'all about um, about the reason why I started a weight loss journey. You know, I'm staying focused and, you know, I just want to be a motivation, you know, to other people out here in the community on, on this platform, YouTube and the reason why I started this weight loss journey, I know my my weight loss journey has been an up and down roller coaster, but you know what? As long as I'm sticking to it and concentrating, because I didn't see too much in my in my weight loss journey, you know. Um, like I like I was telling babe and like I was telling um uh, I can't think of her name now but me and her we was talking and you know I said you know um I just want to be a motivation I want to encourage people you know hey you know I know weight loss I know weight loss on a weight loss journey it's a struggle it really is and I 
been there before. So, you know, but the reason why I, I'm so concerned about a weight loss journey is because, you know, you know, people that have heart trouble and, you know, diabetes and all that, you know, this is the reason why I'm praying to God that once God helped me to reach my weight goal and I'm not giving up, um, I just won't, you know, I just want to be more healthy, you know, low salt diet, you know, because when you eat all these greasy foods like pizza, you know, stuff like that, that stuff will clog up your arteries and, you know, Lord knows, the Lord knows up above. I do not want to have that trouble when I get more older. And so this is the reason why I'm doing this weight loss journey, you know, and uh, watching out for the sodium intake. And like I told Babe, he's got to watch out for what he eats now, you know. Sorry, y'all. Babe, kick y'all. Y'all get on Babe. Don't get on me, y'all. <laughs> 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 I'm just playing y'all. Y'all know y'all know y'all know babe don't mean to, okay? Babe loves y'all, okay? Amen. But um yeah, this is the reason why that I said, you know, cuz before babe got sick, babe would like he would go in the refrigerator and he would say, "Well, big baby, it ain't nothing to eat." Then you say that, babe. Yeah. You know, I, I I'm not putting no words in babe's mouth. Good. I'm just speaking the truth. Babe would go in the refrigerator. He'll look up there. Big baby, what you want to eat? You know, and baby be making me think it ain't nothing in the refrigerator or in the freezer. But then babe say, no, you know what? I don't feel like cooking. Let's order a pizza. You know, but when you eat all that pizza, all that greasy foods, you order in pizza after pizza every month, every month. Look what that's doing to your arteries. You got to clean out your your system, you know. Do a detox, you know, drink, you know, like me. I'm doing this detox drink. I skipped yesterday, but, you know, but this is the reason why I want to take care of myself. And I want baby to take care of himself. And anybody else that's listening to this video, please, you know, I'm praying for you. I'm praying for you because babe, you know, I thank God that babe is back home. And I just thank God, you know, that God was with him in that hospital. Because I'm telling y'all, when it comes to your heart, it's nothing to play with y'all. It's nothing to play with. And babe don't mind me telling his story. You know, he would sit down, he would tell y'all, what, it, what all he done went through. The lady called yesterday and was asking, babe, did you, did you know, do you know why you was, do you know why you wearing this, this life vest? And he said, no. The lady told him that his heart wasn't pumping like it should be. And his heart is weak. So this is the reason why and so they was at the lady asked babe, you know, did when he first had the cough was he having chest pains? And what did you tell the lady? Huh? Now I'm talking about her. Uh, you told her yesterday that your chest was hurting. Yeah. But but you know, once you have once you have heart trouble, the first sign is chest pains and shortness of breath. And this is the reason why I told babe, hey babe, I'm gonna lay off them pieces. I'm gonna lay off the fast foods. And so every time when me and babe would go to the store, he was like, we would go over here to Family Dollar Store. Do you want a uh, hamburger? I said, no babe, no. You know, because you you eat all this stuff, it ain't good.
this and you, you know, I know it looks good. Even when you buy a pizza, yeah, it looks good, don't it, babe? That's right. And babe, and you know, even though this pizza, like from Domino's, you know, whatever place you want to order from, yeah, it looks good. But at the end, in the long run, it's gonna hurt you eventually. So this is the reason why I'm thanking God every morning that he allows me to wake up. Thank you, Father God, for just blessing me to see another morning. Thank you, Father God, just for allowing me to stick to my weight loss journey because I want to be a motivation to somebody. This is me. I've been there. I, I've been there. I've done that. Even when I was in Texas, y'all, I'm telling y'all, I even had a, I even told Babe about this years and years, I mean years ago. Uh, they got this this place called Six Flag Six Flag in Texas, and y'all, I'm telling y'all, this was way before Baby even came into my life. You know, back then, uh, I went to go, I went to go, I went to Six Flags, and I did like this this video. They videotaped me, you know, and I looked on that video. And I told babe, I said, it felt like the way I looked it back then, my jaws was like, like big. I was bloated and I couldn't even hardly breathe. I couldn't hardly do nothing else. But you know what? I thank God. I thank God right today that God is helping me with this weight loss journey. Yeah, I know these other foods sound good. Oh, McDonald's, you know, uh, Wendy's, whatever, Chick-fil-A, you know. But I wanna let, you know, I said to myself, Sherry, you gotta lay off, you gotta lay off the bridge. You gotta lay off the sodas. Now I'm drinking water, more and more water. I don't even crave sodas no more. I don't even crave sweets no more. If I want something to snack on, like these right here, I brought these yesterday. Yesterday was my first time trying it. And they are good, y'all. They they taste way better than the regular cookies. Because when you buy the regular cookies, you're going to be in and ate up the whole bag. The whole thing. If you're not careful. So this is the reason why I wanted to sit down and talk to you all about this this journey that I'm back on. And I'm praying to God that when He helps me to reach my weight goal, I'm praying to God that He will help me to keep it off and to just stick to the healthy foods that are good for me. Because being obesity, you know, being a diabetic, having heart trouble, no good y'all, I'm telling y'all, and I thank God that babe is, you know, you know, I'm making sure he eat healthy, I'm making sure he don't overdo it in his sodium intake, and, you know, I just thank God, you know, and, you know, like I say, why you got a chance. If you still young, take care of yourself while you got a chance. Because when you get up in age, it's hard. It really is. Stay away from the sodas. Drink water. Sometimes if you don't like water, get you some cranberry juice. Drink cranberry juice. Leave all them sodas alone. Sodas is not good for our bodies. It will bust your heart wide open. That's what I heard like years ago. When you drink sodas after sodas after sodas after sodas, I heard that this stuff will bust your heart open. Somebody told me that about a couple of years ago. They said, them sodas is no good for you. 
bust your heart open. And I'm just coming to y'all with this with this video to let people know I'm being a motivation to somebody out there who is struggling to lose weight. But first, before you start on weight loss journey, make sure that you pray to God. Stay focused. Start off slow. Don't rush yourself into, oh, losing weight, and then you're going to pick it back up. Just pray to God each and every day that God will, you know, when God allows you to wake up every morning, just pray to God and say, Lord, help me to control my weight. Help me to get the rest of this weight out for me. And God will, God will be with you all the way through your weight loss goal to your weight loss goal. And once you get to your weight loss goal, pray to God that God will help you to keep it off and don't pick it back up. I'm just speaking the truth, you know. I'm just speaking to somebody out there. Somebody out there needs to hear what I'm saying. I don't know who's this for, but I know one thing. When my, when my people used to tell me, hey, niece, you need to lose that weight. Yeah, I used to get mad. I used to get mad. But you know what? They was telling me for my own good. As I got a little bit older and older, I said, hmm, they telling me for my own good and for my health. Being overweight is not good for nobody. I don't care how tall you are, how tall you are, or whatever, medium, I mean, uh, tall, short, I don't care. Being overweight is not good for us. Some people might think, you know, it, it don't, they don't care. But if you care about your heart, you're going to lose that weight. You're going to do something about it. And I'm just coming on here just to speak on a few things about the reason why I'm on this weight loss journey. And I thank God for putting me back on this weight loss journey. Yeah, sometimes it's hard. It really is. Sometimes I might not feel like getting up, you know, you know, turning on my camera, exercising. But you know what? When I'm off a of camera, I still exercise. Baby's my babe sits right here. He was sitting right here in the living room last night. He was counting for me. I said, I might not feel like going on live. I might not feel like making a video. But still, look what I did last night. I got up. I might have been tired. I was tired from yesterday. But look what I did. I got my weights. I did my modified jumper jacks. I did my ab firm. The other night, I did my, my elliptical. Yeah. I did that. And tonight, what I'm going to do... I'm going to do some wall push-ups. I'm going to stand up against the wall. And I'm going to make a video of that. First, I'm going to do my modified jumping jack. But I'm keeping at this. So if y'all are struggling to lose weight, number one, pray to God. Pray to God. Number two, start off slow. Don't rush. Start off slow. Number three, stay focused. Stay consistent. Just keep on, keep on, keep on, keep on, keep on, keep on, keep on. And God will help you all the way to your weight goal. Whatever you want your weight goal to be. God is there for you. He's helping you all the way through. And I thank God for Him helping me. I really do. I thank God. But I pray this touches somebody's heart out there. Heart, mind, soul, and body. motivation to somebody out there, but it's your choice, if you want to get this weight off of you, it's your choice, stop drinking sodas, start drinking water, start drink, start making yourself drink water, 
pray to God that God will help you to stop drinking sodas. Amen. Love each and every one of y'all. Thank y'all for listening. Give this video a big, big thumbs up or a big thumbs down. It really doesn't matter. A view is just a view. And until the next time, my YT fam, my YT fam, welcome to my video. Welcome to my live. Welcome to our house, my YT fam. Hey, hey, my YT fam, my YT fam. Welcome to my video. Welcome to my live. Welcome to our house, my YT fam. Hey, hey. Boys will until the next time. We love y'all. There's nothing you all can do but to love us back. Amen. 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 And remember, keep your heads up. Keep on smiling. Don't let nobody steal your joy. And remember, peace, love, joy, happiness, kindness. And remember to call somebody. Tell somebody you love them because you know why tomorrow is not promised to no one at all. Until the next time, if the Lord is real, may heaven smile upon you all and upon me, babe, and Gigi. Until the next time, remember, babe, say, say something. Peace, love, and care. And joy. And joy. Peace, love, joy, happiness, kindness. And until the next time, if the Lord is real. And babe said hello. Good and afternoon to all of you. God bless y'all. And y'all keep him lifted up in prayer. Continue to pray for us. We're praying for y'all. Amen. And we love y'all. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Do like this, babe.